Hostess coaching is the ultimate key to party plan. Hostess coaching builds up a relationship between you and your hostess pre-party. This creates her confidence in you that she will have a great party and that you will turn up to do it. Never just assume that a hostess knows how to organise her own party. You need to guide her and help her during the series of phone calls on the weeks before her party. By doing this effectively and successfully, you'll enjoy a bigger wages, more party bookings and greater success in your and summer's business. Lack of or no hostess coaching is like turning up to do a party, dumping your kit case in the middle of the lounge and hoping for the best. It just won't happen. Our most successful high-earning organisers understand and embrace effective hostess coaching 100%. They will always have a minimum of six parties in their lineup, and their average minimum party sits around £300. You join Dan Summers to earn the most money you can. Lack of coaching will only give you minimum or no wages at all. During this audio, we will give you some ideas on how to hostess coach well. Feel free to use your own ideas or challenges too. But even if you only follow these guidelines, you are guaranteed more success and higher earnings. Hello. Hi, is that Marianne? Yes, it is. Hi, Marianne. It's Suzanne from Anne Summers here. How are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. Yourself? Uh, not too bad, thanks. Not too bad at all. Marianne, did you get my wee letter for saving the date for your party for the 25th? Yes, I did, thank you. Brilliant. And is the 25th still okay for you? Yeah, that's great. Brilliant. So what we'll do now that obviously we've confirmed that is we will send you a full hostess pack. Um, so I'll do that tomorrow, I'll send that off to you and I'll give you a wee phone um, just to go through the contents. There'll be some catalogues and order forms and different things in there for you. Um, Marianne, have you got Facebook? Yes, I do actually. Right, well, do you know how to set up a Facebook event? Yes, I do. Right, well, this is a great thing where a lot of our hostesses have been finding they're working really well from them. If you set up a Facebook event on your page and invite all your friends, if you invite me to it as well, my email address is in the bottom of that letter, and um, what I can do is I can post some pictures and things on um, any special offers or any promotions we've got on as well. I can pop them on your event for you. Keep you know keep the girls um, up to date with what's going on um, and keep reminding them obviously when your party is. Oh, that would be great. Right, no bother. Well, I'll get a hostess pack off to you uh, tomorrow and uh, I'll be back in touch next week and we'll go through the pack. Is that okay? That's smashing. Oh, thanks, Marianne. Take care. You too. Bye. Bye. Hello. Hi, Marianne. Yes, it is. Hi, Marianne. It's Suzanne from Anne Summers here. Hi, yeah. How are you doing? Oh, I'm great, thanks. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Good, good. What's this weather like? It's scorching, isn't it? Oh, it's lovely. Long may it bloom and continue, I tell you. Yep. Uh, Marianne, did you get your hostess pack? Yes, I did. I got it the other day there. Thanks. Brilliant. Have you had the chance to go through it all yet? Um, I've just had a quick look through it. I've not went into it in detail, to be honest with right. you. Have you got it handy? Um, can you give me a wee second? Aye, no problem. Hello. Oh, hi there. You got it? Yep, I've got fab, it. Fab, fab. Right, in there you'll find, I've put some catalogues and order forms in there, Marianne, that you would be, these are no for you to give me at the night of the party. What these are for is, have you invited some people who have said they can't come that night? I've got a couple of girls from my work who can't make it. Right. Take the catalogues and some order forms into your work because any orders they place will go towards your commission on the night as well. Oh, right, I didn't realise that. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So that's a great way of getting extra orders and boosting up your commission as well for people. Plus, it's a wee bit of a guilt trip if they can't come at your party. You can say that gives a wee order then, you know. Um, so use your catalogues and order forms for that. If you need any more, drop me a wee text or an email or whatever. I'll happily send you through some more or if I can, I'm passing, I can drop some in. How many girls do you think you're expecting? Well, the now I've had... And on my Facebook events page, because I did set one up, um, I've got 10 girls who are saying they're definitely coming, and right. I've got another three or four who are saying maybe at the moment. Right, okay. Um, You will get a natural drop-off. So if 10 people say they're coming, you'll probably end up with about seven on the night. It's just one of these things. I've done this job for a lot of years, and you do find that things crop up for people, you know, what things happen. I would advise you to over-invite. 
you know, if your lounge holds 18, 20 people, I would invite 30, you mm-hmm. know, and I know, well, if they all turn up, don't worry about it, we'll, we'll cram them in, but, you know, at least then you're going to get the most out of your party that you, you know, you possibly can. Um, so that's one tip that I always give hostesses is over invite and tell people they can bring a friend as well because some people don't realise that they can bring somebody along with them, maybe somebody that you don't know. Is that okay? Yeah, that's fine. Brilliant. Yep. Now you've got you've got um, invitations in there as well. These are handy for your neighbours and things to get to one of the kids maybe to pop them through your neighbour's doors so that way they know you're having a party. Yeah, well I've already handed some out already because um, some of my friends aren't actually on Facebook so right. I've had to do that anyway. So Brilliant. And you can back that up with a wee text or something as well. Um, didn't go mad with food, Mariana. I got a lot of hostesses getting stressed out and preparing great big huge hot buffets and everything like that. This is for you to get something out of. Um, by way, your hostess gifts and your commission, and I don't want you being stressed. And you know, just a few wee nibbles and tell the girls to bring their bottle of wine or whatever they're drinking, you know. But honestly, don't get stressed out creating uh, a great big buffet or anything like that. Right, no bother. Um, right, so your outside order, you I've said to you about that, um, and your invitation, so that's brilliant. Now, you've just seen in there a sweet steak sheet. Yeah, I wasn't very sure what to do with that. Right, what that is, is you sell them to people for £2 a square. Now, this is great, maybe you could get your husband to take it into work, and again, all those people who can't make it, you're not necessarily going to want to sp- sell them to the girls on the night of the party, because I'll have loads of other things that they can win at the party. This is maybe for people that can't come, people from your work, your neighbours, your family, or whatever. Now, if you sell all those squares, Marianne, you'll, have, you'll get £50 of products in the catalogue, absolutely free before you even start with your commission wow i know it's really good doesn't it yeah it sure is um so and we'll have one winner winning 50 pounds worth as well so that's a brilliant thing to go for as well now talking about things for the catalogue if, if you had a look at the catalogue in your fancy yeah i do i love your capri bikini oh it's gorgeous absolutely love you it. going on holiday yeah we've booked a wee week in benidorm in june oh, and fab? i absolutely love that wee bikini i just love it well listen you get you know, if you've got about 15 girls minimum at your party, looking at the national average, that could be yours for free. <gasps> Fab. Um, and obviously you've got your sweet steak there as well. You could even order it with your sweet steak. Um, so, you know, the, the, we really do offer a lot to the hostesses. Um, so, you know, it's all there for the taking. As well as, of course, your 10% commission on whatever the guests spend. But listen, I'll not keep you any longer. It's getting to EastEnders time, isn't it? That is that. That is that. <laughs> uh, and I'll speak to you again really soon, Marianne, OK? OK, thanks again. Take... <laughs> I've got your laugh. Sorry. Hello. Marianne. Yes. Hiya, it's Suzanne from Anne Summers. Hiya, how are you doing? Oh, I'm great. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Fab. Marianne, how's things going? Oh, I'm getting my kill at some of these lasses on your event page. They're mental. Oh, I know. There's a few of them are totally mental and they're up for such a good laugh and a carry on. I'm oh. really looking forward to it. Oh, listen, I can't tell you how much I'm looking forward to your party because they just seem like such a nice crowd. Oh, they are. They're a really nice bunch of girls. Good. How, how many do you think you've got coming then? Um, well, that's us up to 13 on my Facebook page. Mm-hmm. And then I've got another three girls, uh, my friends who are coming, who are new on my Facebook page. So that takes us up to about 15, 16. Oh, brilliant. Well, just Keep reminding them, obviously, um, on the build up to the party, and tell them they can bring somebody with them as well, because that all helps you with your commission, Marianne. Oh, great, I will do. What about your sweepstake? How are you getting on with that? Um, well, I've got, I think, um, I've got about thirty-five filled in so far. Mm-hmm. So, um, another fifteen to go. But don't you worry, um, I'll have it filled in for you coming. You're wanting that bikini, aren't you? I am having that <laughs> bikini, and I really don't want to be paying for it. <laughs> and what about orders? Did you manage to get any orders for people that can't make it? Well, two of the girls my work can't make it so um i've used the order form she sent me and um, they've placed a wee order with me as well so right. i've got that for you coming as well oh brilliant and do you need any more order forms um maybe if you could pop in another couple because there might be a cu- another couple of girls at my work they were kind of having a wee look at the brochure right um so at least then if they decide to place an order i've got a couple of order forms sitting there for them anyway all right no bother that's brilliant i'll do that for you i'll get them in the post to you tomorrow thank you um now here's another wee thing for you marianne um, obviously in my letter when you first get your hostess pack you get 10% commission based on the guest's 
sales as long as your sales are over 180 pounds but obviously looking at your guest list that's not going to be a problem um but to get our hostess gift um you need two people to book a party now obviously i'll push to get your party bookings on the night of your party from the girls that are there but have a go at some of the girls that have told you they can't make it right see if they'll maybe book a party uh -huh. um if you can get me two party bookings um, from people who can't make it, not the girls at the party, but from people who can't make it. And if you get them secured for me with dates and get me their names and addresses, um, I'll bring a bottle of shots along to the party for your first game and um, get the party going. Ooh, that sounds like a plan. <laughs> I'll definitely look into that. I'll start putting a wee bit of pressure on a couple of them. Well, that's it. That's it. And listen, you know, once people are booked and they know their party's going to hold, people get into it, you know, and it, it, it's good fun. Um, so hopefully you'll get that, no problem at all. Um, is there anything else that you're not sure about or anything else I can help you with just now, Marianne? No, that's, uh, you've covered that one, maybe. I know exactly what I'm doing now. Oh, brilliant. Oh, listen, I really can't wait to see you soon, but I'll, I'll give you another wee phone next week before the party. Okay, okay, thanks for phoning again. No bother, Marianne. Cheerio. Bye. 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 Hello, Suzanne. Oh, hiya, you know it's me. I do that. I'm added you to my contact, Suzanne Ann Summers. Oh, fab, fab. How's tricks? Fine, thank you. And yourself? Aye, okay. Did you have a good weekend? I did, aye, I did that. Hate Mondays, though. Oh, you and me both. It was a struggle to get up this morning and struggling even more to get the kids up for school. Oh, is it the two, the two wee boys you've got, eh? Yeah, two, two boys, yep. Oh, fab. And do you... No work on a Monday? Um, no, Mondays, uh, I only work part-time, Suzanne, eh, because I've got the kids at school, so I only work um, part-time hours, eh? Oh, right, okay. I am the same, actually. I just I do this part-time part and my other job part-time. Um, what, you know, fancy having a, uh, some information about Dana and Summers, Marianne? Oh, I don't know if I could see your job. How? Oh, I don't know if I've had the confidence to do it. Oh, God. Well, I used mm. to feel like that, but once I got started, I found that, you know, you went in people's pussies and... I mean, they didn't ken who you are, and it is actually really good fun. It's like getting paid to go on a night out every weekend. Oh, sounds like fun, right enough. Well, listen, what about, you've, I mean, you've done brilliant arranging your party and everything like that, so you're almost there. I mean, that, there doesn't any more really required to do it than going out and doing the parties, and we give everybody full training and supply the kit and everything like that. Oh, that sounds really good. You will I bring some information while you have a look at it at the weekend. Oh, that would be great if you don't mind. Aye, and I'll, I'll certainly consider it. Fab, fab. So what, how are we sitting numbers wise now? Well, I've got 13 definites on my Facebook page and then I've got, um, I've got another three get, uh, other folks that are coming along. Um, so that takes us up to about 15, 16 years coming. Brilliant, brilliant. Um, we'll just keep uh, reminding them as the, the week goes in that it's your party on Saturday night and everything like that. Maybe drop them all a wee text again about Wednesday. Uh, just tell them you're looking forward to seeing them. I'm really looking forward to it. Some of these lasses are mental. Who is this woman, Jinty, on your event? Oh, she's one of my pals and she is mental, but mental in a good way. She's so much fun and she's up for such a good laugh. Oh, do you know this? I've, I've got my babysitter organised and like my man's working on Saturday night. So uh, I, oh, it's been a while since I've been looking forward to a party as much as yours, Marianne. I really am looking forward to it. What about your sweet steak? How are you getting on with that? That's me. We've got it um, completed now. Mm -hmm. I've got it because I was having that bikini. Oh, good for you. Brilliant. That's fantastic. Well, we'll draw that on the night. Um, and what about your outside orders? How did you go on with the lasses for your work? I three of them have placed an order, so that's me got the three outside orders for you coming as well. Um, so I we've definitely placed an order as well. Oh, that's great. And um, any bookings? I want to bring you a bottle of shots. Um, I've got a definite one. Mm -hmm. um, one of the girls from my work's definitely booked, and the other one's um, going to get back to me um, tomorrow or Wednesday. All so right. Hopefully, I'll have it. Um, what I can do is once I get her information and a party date from her, um, I'll, is it all right for me to give you a call? I that that'll be brilliant, doll. That's fantastic. Give me the details of the one that has booked then. Right, it's um. A girl called Angela Shaw. Uh huh. And what else do you need, Suzanne? What date is she wanting? Um, she's wanting the twelfth of May. Uh huh. And her address is forty four Glen Ammond in Whitburn. Mm hmm. And anything else? Our phone number, please. It's zero one five zero one seven four two five three one. Oh, that's my. Well, what's now? She's halfway there. Uh, well, fingers crossed. When I get off the phone for you, then now what I'll do is I'll contact that girl from my work and uh, I'll see if she'll commit to a date. And then, is it all right to give you a wee call back with information? That's absolutely brilliant, Marianne. Just do that and I'll give you a wee phone at the end of the week. 
um, just to tie up with you for before the party starts. That's great. All right, doll. Speak to you soon. You too. Bye. 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 Hello. Hello. Hiya, is that Party Central? It sure is. How are you doing? I'm all right. You're set? Oh, I'm all excited. Fab, fab. Last night, can you just want to let you know that I'm on my way? Um, I've, I'm passing a shop. Are you needing anything brought in, doll? No, I've got everything organised. Oh, Suzanne, fab. Thanks. No bother. Right, I'll see you in about half an hour. Okay, dokie. Cheers, Marianne. Bye. Bye. Over the months and years with Anne Summers, you'll find that hostess coaching actually becomes a bit of an art. And you'll begin to notice things that your hostess says and behaviours that she shows over the phone as sometimes a warning signal that she may be looking to cancel or that you can just tell that she's not really put much effort into planning a party. Um, there's still plenty of time to salvage that party if you play it very clever. Hello. Hi, Marianne. Hi, Isa. Uh, hi. hi, Hen. It's Suzanne from Anne Summers. How are you? Oh, I'm all right, thanks. Good, good. I just don't really want to um, catch up with you, but your party on the 25th, how's things going? Oh, no so great, no so great. Oh, what's wrong? Um, well, I mean, I set up a Facebook page like you told me to, um, and I've only got really five girls that I've confirmed. And right. I've got ten maybes, but I just, I just don't know. I, I really just don't know. Right, okay, you feel a wee bit flat with that? Yeah, am I? I'm a wee bit disappointed, really, and all my friends, you know. Oh, listen, it's always your friends that will let you down. But see the five girls that are coming? Even if you get in touch with them and ask them to bring a friend with them. Right, uh-huh. That brings your numbers up to ten. Right, okay. Um, I tell you, Marianne, we've got a wee bit of a promotion going on in the unit just now with my manager. Um, and I want to enter you into it. I'll tell you more about it, but listen... If you, if I give you a wee phone back tomorrow night, what, what to do is get in touch with these five girls who are definitely coming. Right. Ask them if they've got a friend or a workmate or a family member or whatever that they can bring with them. Uh-huh. Um, and if each one of them do that, you've, that's your numbers up to ten. But have another wee go with your phone through your text messages and just people who have no go back to you or whatever and say, look, my party's on the 25th, I really hope you can make it. Um, and see what response you get to that. And what I'll do is I'll give you a wee phone back tomorrow night um, and I'll let you know about this competition. For, it's for free and some of products actually my manager's running and I really want to enter you into it. But um, have a go at that tonight and maybe tomorrow and I'll give you a wee phone tomorrow night. Is that okay? Aye, that sounds great. All right, I'll speak to you tomorrow. Okay, thanks. Bye. Bye. Hiya, it's Suzanne from Anne Summers. Oh, hiya. How are you doing? I'm all right, Good, yes. good, good, good. Right, I want to tell you about this, uh, these freebies that you might have won off my, my manager. But it was just, how did you go on with your inviting other people? Well, I phoned her in last night to the five girls that are coming. And I basically said to them what to bring a friend. But they didn't realise that they could bring, like, their sister-in-law or whatever along with Aye. them. So I think... Um, there's four of them going to bring somebody else along with them. Oh, great! So that should be as up to about eight or nine now. So that's sounding a wee bit better. Fantastic. Fine. Well, listen, um, it looks like we have a Hostess of the Week competition. Um, and uh, your name has come out in the draw. So I've got a wee prize to bring along with me on Saturday night uh, for my manager. Woohoo! Brilliant, eh? Yeah, it sure is. So um, just keep on top of these lassies and don't worry about it, don't let it get you doing, you know, whether there's 8 there or 18, we'll still have a brilliant night, Marianne. Oh, that's good, 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 because I was all worried about that and stuff like that, thinking you had to have a minimum amount at your party. Uh-huh. Um, but no, that's great, that's smashing. That's brilliant, but listen, I'll give you a phone on Saturday, all right? No bother. Cheers, doll. Bye. Bye. Bye.